So we have Bill Phillips back with us. This is the uh, public information officer for Lawrence County working with emergency management there. Bill, thank you so much for taking the uh, time to join us tonight. Good, good evening. We are we are trying to uh, determine just exactly what we have down here at this point. We are we are certain that we have had multiple touchdowns in Wayne County and in northwestern Lawrence County. We're trying to work out the specific locations at this time. Uh, due to the fact that it is dark and the storms have been very fast moving, we are a bit uncertain ex to the exact track that we have. We don't have any information at this point about damage or anything of that nature, but we do have uh, numerous areas that we have had apparent touchdowns, quite a bit of tree debris, things of that nature. Bill, thank you so much for sharing that information with us. Are you able to share um, any specific damage reports that have come in or if there have been any reports of injuries or any any rescues that y'all may have had need to do may have had to do this evening? At this point, we have no reports of injuries and no reports of uh, rescues. We have had several reports of uh, trees uh, down. Most of the specific reports have been in Wayne County along uh, Bridges Road and uh, Natural Bridge Road is uh, and I'm going from memory here, but uh, that would be in Wayne County. In uh, Lawrence County, we are a bit uncertain. There has been a lot of reports, a lot of sightings of uh, funnels and touchdowns, but we do not have any uh, damage reports and uh, cannot give any further specifics at this point. Thank you for that, Bill. Have there been many reports of power outages across the area or down power lines that you want residents to know about? We have heard of power outages south of Waynesboro. I have not uh, heard of anything in Lawrence County at this point. However, I have not uh, specifically tried to uh, flesh that out. Thank you so much. And uh, if there's any other information that you want residents to know there, if there are certain roadways that you need them to be avoiding, please continue to share that information with us as well. Well, at this point, the best advice we can give is uh, as the warnings are in effect, please be sure to take and continue to remain undercover. Uh, basically, at this point, roads feeding into State Route 240, which we call the turnpike, uh, we would advise that they avoid those roads at this point unless until we uh, have determined that they are, in fact, open and safe to uh, pass. Bill, thank you so much for that information. We appreciate you joining us tonight. We know your crews are going to be hard at work uh, getting things cleaned up here. Right. We are going to let you go so that you can get back to the important work that you're doing. Thank you. Thank you.